Bitch, stupid. I wouldn't, I wouldn't inject. The, I wouldn't like squirt this into my mouth. This is like, I've been filling this up full of all full of weird shit. <laughs> Just yesterday, I had fucking ketamine in there. You wouldn't inject the water, bro. You wouldn't I, download I went, a car, would you? I went to a I went to a party when I was younger. I went to a party when I was younger, and some dude took ketamine, and and his friend like lit his like ear on fire. And he didn't notice, because he was on ketamine. And here I am, like, sitting there, like, you know, at the ripe, at the age of 17, being like, I don't drink, and just watching this dude getting his ear light on fire, and me just thinking to myself, what the fuck have I gotten myself into? It didn't work, Rosie. What do you mean it didn't work? So lost. <laughs> yeah, I know. Right. Right. <laughs> ha! <laughs> An orcs in the boys. Orcs in the boys. That's actually orcs, what it's orcs, called now. That's not a joke. Orcs, 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 orcs. Orcs, I see Josh still using the ruined plane for the titles, and that's not coming back. That's not a joke. Don't worry, it's still ruined. Yeah, it's now actually just the other kind of ruined. Like, so, should I not continue to update the calendar? Oh, I updated it again. My calendar, not the public calendar. Is my guess of uh, the 4th of Ulsa correct? Uh, let me take a look at my calendar. Because it was like one week and two days. No, it was like one week and four days. Yes. No, no. Ulsa was the month you started in. Was it? It was. We started on the twenty seventh. Mhm. Mm oh yeah. Eighth of. Eighth of the month. Since then, you slept. At the inn on the first night. Look, I'm not entirely sure. I shouldn't say this, but I'm not entirely sure on the actual date. Because I forgot to update it for like two sessions. But by my approximate ca calculations, it's roughly the 11th of oh, September. Pin me off by a couple of days. That's like the night or two you guys spent in Dawnhold, the week you spent sailing. And then a little bit of the time you spent in the woods. Not that it matters, you guys have apparently decided. Uh, Alright, getting ahead of myself. In the forest, after dealing with the hobgoblins who tried to rob you, you continued your search to find Ugrok, a wolf. Wait, but he has a bear! Why does he need a wolf? We're getting there, okay? So, on this journey, attempting to follow the wolf tracks, you came across a small cave, which turned out to be a uh, lot bigger than expected, where a bunch of oops, were inside, but outside, the east down in the dirt was Victoria. Hello. The somewhat insane cleric. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I could think, I think we could skip over somewhat and just straight to insane cleric. Heading in, you fought through the and the ogre that had apparently tamed them. Stealing some of his loot and adopting the baby bear that he had been raising. I need to give Oscar a new token again. Exists!
Still dead. I'm, uh, I'm not seeing it. Have, have you actually uploaded a new image for it? I, I did. Uh, okay. I'm just asking because remember. Yeah, it's there, but. I still I see the know. old one, so I can't tell. Just delete it. Uh, upload I it again. I swear if it's the same image, but with an MS Paint fucking mustache <laughs> on it, I would. Why oh. can't I add him onto the object layer? I'm just gonna refresh my game, whatever. On your way back out, uh, on your way back out of the forest, you ran into a flock of birds that attacked you. Did some uh, heavy damage before uh, being scared off, both from uh, Sunrise's dragon fear and also just from having killed most of them. <laughs> the few remaining live ones fleeing. For some reason, a decision was reached to return to Dawnhold. Though this will be on foot, which will take a bit of time. So, that brings us up to now. I can't... I... Oh! No, I, I figured it out, okay. I figured out what the issue was. What did I do wrong? It wasn't you, I forgot to unbind the old non-existent token. I so live... It was, to, it was trying to load an asset that did not exist. Ah. That looks like the same picture. Please stop breaking your token. I don't know how I'm doing it, but I'll Please try to tell. Stop erasing your assets. Too powerful for even. I don't go. know how. Just stop doing it. Okay. Alright. Get premium, ah. dude. Premium! <laughs> so, what would everyone like to do? Toria briefly wakes up and goes, I sleep, and then continues to sleep. <laughs> right. Seems reasonable. Now she gone, go sleep, IRL. Exactly! I had to, I had to do something, I felt bad if I didn't do anything. <laughs> I'll probably have a ration and then... Take out my weavers kit and start fixing my fucked up cloak again. Wait, who's the one carry carry Victoria? Ah, uh, me. Literal. The crazy paladin. Thanks. <laughs> the crazy paladin just has Girl, this man. small cleric underneath her. Paladin mama. Underneath her arm or over her shoulder, one of the two. Anyway, I now sleep in our real life. Okay. No, no retarded favor. <laughs> you have a good night. I will do. Okay. Bye bye. She's dead. Have you just done like that? The cleric has fallen into a coma. Definitely need to make good headway, I would imagine, today. I don't exactly feel like sticking around for more birds to return. Mm hmm. Right, let's get walking. It's gonna take us a long time. Might as well get moving now. Yeah, alright. You know, just shuffling the toy over my shoulder, or whatever, just a bit somewhat comfortable to carry her. You intend to carry that woman the whole way back? 
Well, it's better leaving it there to die. Well, be eaten. Hmm. Yes. I was just you want to help us out, give you useful healing, so. When she wakes up, she can do that. Come on, Maui. No resistance. Do, do lead the way then. We follow the river. Mm -hmm. Follow, follow, follow. Well, we have to leave the forest first. Mm -hmm. oh. Well, we need to find. Usually, the river. following the river is the easiest way to go. Do y'all remember which way the roofer is? I have Wanderer background, so I'm pretty sure I do. Dude, same. Oh, and we both know then. Yeah. Your background feature is not that difficult to head back the way you can. It'll just take a long time. Yeah, it's quite some distance. Uh, is there anything you guys want to do along the way? I look for food for Matt. <laughs> I, I mean, I also scavenge some food, but also, um, I don't know, I would probably point out to different areas of locations <laughs> where food might be. And... Actually, go to an insider history, you know, inside chat to see if I know of any, like, small town, small, like, villages nearby, or towns, or if a sort. Um, on the way down. Not really, no. Ah. Just go walking them. I think I was just <laughs> keeping my eyes out for anything interesting. Creatures, ruins, even just seemingly abandoned sites. Quickly, do you guys want to travel? I would imagine at a pretty natural pace. Normal. Yeah. Normal pace. Not exactly yeah, not all that concerned. Fast enough for the bear to keep up. <laughs> Fast enough. I don't want to you know, attract too much attention by making too much noise, I guess. Casual. No, who cares about that? Let's be noisy. AF. Try to stay uh, not right next to the river because of the uh, water elemental problem. Yeah, well... <laughs> How close to the river do you want to be? At least keep it in eyesight. Mm. Yeah, close enough that we can see it. 60 feet ish. I don't know. As long as we stay in a tree line, we should be right. Then imagine there's a bit more distance, because I can't be bothered stretching the map that far. That's fair. It works. Alright, brother. I mean, <clears throat> alright, brother. <laughs> My god, his age regressed. You're alright there. He's been cursed. So, along the way. Home boy. Sure. Mm -hmm. First couple of days, uneventfully. With all of your background features, I don't really need you to for getting food or anything. On the third day, mm -hmm. Jesus Rose. Fun? See... Don't worry about it. <laughs> Fuck up, the uh, group of people sitting by the kitchen. I 
approach them pretty casually. Unless something seems off about them. Do they look well armed? Yeah, well, perception. Uh, you could totally take these guys in a fight. I was just wondering if they would like dressed like they would turn to rock people, or they're just like fishermen. No, they are clearly just a group of fishermen. Let's see, there's. They have a small dinghy that has been pulled up onto the shore. Hey, if they hit, maybe we're close to something. Must be something around here. Let's go ask him. Do they look like filthy humies? Yes. Hey, humies! What? What? You see, uh, one of them turns around. <laughs> see, they see you two orcs. They go, oh shit, orcs! Calm down, orcs. calm down. No, we're half orcs. Roll deception. <laughs> That's so cool. See, the one who was shouting kind of calms down. The others are like both like th still throwing their gear back into the dinghy. It's like wait, wait, wait. As the uh, oh, takes a right. close look, and he realizes only two of you are rocks. <laughs> We were just. <laughs> He's not gonna eat us. We were just wondering if you uh, knew how close Dawnhold was and if there was anything else around. Possible resupply. Dawnhold? It's a. Uh, if you're on foot, that's. That's a good week of walking. Well, that's at least good to know. Are you not from Donald? Oh no, we're from a village nearby here. It's just on the other side of the river. Oh, well, where is oh it? What village is it? I don't really have a name. Uh, is there a main road leading to Donald th for through there? Not really, no. Everyone just takes the river. Hmm. You say they will shove across the river? Yeah, our village. Are you dead? The other guy like quickly covers his mouth. <laughs> I just stare at him for a moment with that cranky face I have at all, at all time. <laughs> Sorry. If we uh, can manage to procure a boat, we could. Speed up our trip. Yeah, along. is your village big enough to have a spare boat for us? Yes, hopefully. Uh, there might be a dinghy lying around, but I don't think it's going to be much easier taking that upriver compared to walking. Oh, yeah, it's upriver. Mm. That's how water works. How? Oh. Alright. Guess we'll we keep walking, might as well then. have a look at. We can either keep walking, or we can look at that village. What do you think? Yeah, it's just a little fishing village. What, what could they have that we want? Stuff for me. Hmm. Pretty sure. Pretty sure I found our best old fish. Something to do. Fair point. I doubt you have had uh, much well, issues, considering everything is being fairly peaceful around here. Uh, yeah, too peaceful. There's been a few ill tidings from uh, the mountains, but nothing too bad. It's not like people are going missing or anything. What kind of ill tidings from the mountains? Uh, whispers of 
ghosts and hauntings. We just yep. avoid that area now. It's a lot easier to deal with that way. What do you think, Ugo? Oh, Darby. <laughs> Mm. Horn things. They're not good. No, they're not, but they're usually something that provides a better challenge. I'm all up for fighting, but how do you fight a ghost? It's already dead. Oh, well, that's if it is a ghost. He heard him. He said you ghosts. You haven't found coming back to. You haven't coming back alive. Curses and stuff. Nothing to mock. From your shaman, I presume. Do you know about this? What? You hear about this from your shaman, right? Darby? What? Curses undeadened in the light? Yeah. We's not like that stuff. Too much heebie jeebie stuff. Mm. Bad, bad for grumps. Well, more reason to get rid of it, right? More reason to avoid it. But if it can't be helped... I don't really see a reason why we should go to the mountains. I just figured you'd travel that way eventually. Maybe. But at a moment, not really interested in spooky ghosts. <laughs> uh, then, I guess we press on. Mice as well. If we're all good for supplies. <laughs> Just look at the fishes. You got any spare fish? You got any spare coin? <laughs> oh, little. Jinkle's pocket. Well, I think we can come to a bit of an agreement. See, he pulls a pocket back out of the dinghy. Just grabs like a large carp by the tail and pulls it up. We got a few good ones today. You know, if you're willing to trade. I like to kneel down to Matt and just, how's that looking for you? I like point at the fish. <laughs> I think that's a yes. <laughs> you want me to ask him? If you want, yeah. I can't speak with animals. Matt, you want the fishies? Do you like fish? Yes. Yeah, Matt likes the fishies. Knew it. Get me the fish. We want fish. <laughs> All right. Well, given these ones are relatively fresh, be a gold piece each. But I gotta keep a couple of them, you know. Feed the family. Gold piece for a fish. Don't know about you, brother, but that seems a mighty bit expensive. That's that's like ten. Well, fish. would you rather walk for a week back to Dawnhold to buy some? Would you rather crawl? See, uh, st puts like one leg into the boat. <laughs> we can just leave you here, you know! Uh, uh, how many fish do you have? Uh, right now we've got, uh, five. If I buy all five, five can three. I get it for four gold?
Four gold for three fish. I told you I'm keeping a couple. I'll buy I'll buy the three for three. Well uh <laughs> See uh looks at you guys uh you have anything to carry them in? Yeah, hands. Yeah, match stomach. Well, if you want to be, if you want to do it like that, I'm not gonna stop you. Just pulls three fish out of the bucket. Break them with you, give me, the rest. Give me every fucking gold. Give Matt one of the uh, the bigger fishies they were showing. There you go, buddy. Good. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus Christ, Darren. More! More! Well. <sighs> Might as well keep traveling and then set up a little bit later. Have a nice meal. Might as well. Yeah. Right. Shit up camp a little bit further up. Thanks for the fish. Uh, you're welcome. You have a uh, come by. Uh, come by the village near here. Keep an eye out for us. Will do. Get you a drink. All right. By the way, which mountain pass was it that uh, you've been avoiding, just so we don't bump into it on the way? Uh, if you're on this side of the river, you won't have to worry about it. Oh, that's good then. Okay, real quick, I'm gonna teach Matt. Uh, we ask, when we ask her a question. Raise left paw for yes and right paw for no. All right, roll animal handling. Okay. Claw. <laughs> claw face for yes, claw race for no. <laughs> See, he just completely does not understand. And has now gotten the idea that beg for food is raise hand. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> to which Can he I... is currently doing. <laughs> Can I attempt to correct this behavior? <laughs> <laughs> sure. Roll animal handling at disadvantage. Hell yeah. Wank. I mean, it's better at it's least. Better. Hmm. He still doesn't quite get it, but he at least puts his paws back down. <laughs> <laughs> We'll work it out a bit later. Maybe we're when we're not there. traveling. Just still you. She'll get. Yeah. Must have really liked that fish. I have to buy some fishing lines so we'll be able to catch more of our own without having to pay for it. Mm hmm. How's the, uh, muffin? What? What? What's a muffin? Don't worry, it's a personal joke amongst us, Dragonborn, and points to, uh, Victoria. Well, she's... Uh, still, she's still sleeping. Right. She's sleeping. Yeah, she's sleeping, just... Carol and... Pretty lucky hey, you'd, you'd have full health by now, Nate. I don't know, so to change it yet. <laughs> yes. Is her name far. Muffin now? The Muffin Man? Who lives on Drury Lane? <laughs> well, she's married to 
The Muffin Man. No. No, show me. It's a, uh, hmm. well, an insult, usually to it's those who wish to die. I've never heard one before. All right, then. Like I said, it's normally a call that much worthless. Yeah. It's definitely not one I thought of, man. <laughs> <laughs> She's a muffin top. <laughs> so, you guys continue walking along the river? Yeah. Might as well. Yeah. Carry on my right. <laughs> Along your way. At some point, I cast the tech portal. And assume I At find nothing. <laughs> yes. Uh, what's the range on it again? One mile. Nothing. <laughs> Yeah. Isn't it supposed to be five miles? Wait, wait, wait. Within your, uh, or within six terrain. miles if I'm within my favorite terrain. What's your favorite terrain? Forest. <laughs> well, you're not in a forest now, so... <laughs> We're in the river. Yeah. Or a grass field sort of thing? Yeah, more of a grassland. God, regular ranger's ass. Yeah. Eight, 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 eight. <laughs> so, another two days pass, and uh, the strangest thing happens. You set up camp for a night with not but the open plains and sign. When you get up the net, and when the sun rises the next morning, roughly half a mile away just faintly see it is a building next to the river which was not there the day the night before the fuck what's that I was not here earlier it, it could be appear. not normal let's go have a look alright cautiously Tune just to just carry Troy on my on her arm again. You know that, that looks kind of freaky, and maybe we should. Mm. Well, that would just be fucking boring, now, wouldn't it? And I start walking that direction. You're right. I, I am immensely bored. Let's go. Yeah, he's just yeah. a building. Can't harm it. Doesn't take too long to walk half a mile. Yeah, but what's it? Pun. I'm talking to it, It's just a building. Can't cause too much harm. As you uh, get closer to it, you see there are a couple of people sitting outside having a, having a chat. Even Easy. the very earth around the building seems to have molded around it to be to, to make it look as if this building has been here the entire time. <laughs> oh. Maybe it was here. We're just bad at remembering. I don't think so, brother. I think we'd remember something like that. Good evening. See, All right. One of the uh, people with the drink. Uh, one of the tables of people with drinks, I mean, they're like, Hello? Hello. Hello. <laughs> What's this? Well, it's a tavern. Oh, no, you did it. <laughs> <laughs> What's it doing here? Well, it stopped here, didn't it? What do you mean, stopped? Buildings don't move. Well, this one does. What? Explain. He uh, points up to the small hanging sign out the front. He goes, this is the Wonder Inn. Oh Moves God. around. <laughs> they got good food, good drinks, but take care because people are known to uh, 
wake up in completely different parts of the country. Oh, that's Not awesome. the kind of place you want to be passing out. <laughs> right. Mm -hmm. If it moves, do you think it'll take us to Donald? Well, if it's headed that way. Is it headed that way? Do you know? No, nah, haven't asked. Some of us, we like the adventure of it, you know? See where we end up. Hmm. Well, that sounds alright. Sounds entertaining. So, is is the building alive? Or no. she got the egg or something? Never thought to ask. You want to know all that? Why don't you go ask the bartender instead? It's his place. All right, sure he knows go. how it works. Let's go do that. I was going to use your drink. And we go in. Yeah. We go inside. Uh, we wander in. Yeah. I'll hit you. Through the front entrance. <laughs> what are you talking about? We're wandering. Oh, there's so many people. Cracks knuckles. All right, bar fight. <laughs> <laughs> there's a there's a bell hooked up to the front doors that gives a light jingle as you enter. The bartender calls out, "Oh, I haven't seen you lot before." We just came in. First time seeing this place. Hey, the, the people outside, they say this, this inn moves. How does it do that? Well, it's a bit of a trade secret. Okay, now tell me. telling everyone how I run my business, wouldn't have much of a business left, would I? I suppose. Yes. Alright, can you tell us where it's going then? Well, right now, I was thinking of taking us. Hmm. See, so uh, sits down. He <laughs> like leans onto the counter for a moment. Ugh. I think east sounds pretty good. Is not hold east. I think don't hold was north. No west. No, the forest was north, so don't hold would be south. Right. Wasn't the first east? Is Dawnhold east? Where we are now, Dawnhold would be southwest. Right, that's not where we're going. What exactly is off to the east? Well, there's a smaller mountain range. Uh, don't think I'm going to try and cross the Burning Sea. That would be a bit too much of a pain, and I don't think my customers would appreciate it. Sounds like it would be a very heated endeavour. Well, yeah, pretty much. Right, well, we're trying to get to Dorhold, so we'll have some drinks and then be on our way. Alright, we don't plan on moving until later on tonight, so no worries. Good, good. Uh, how much for a mug? Uh, it depends what you want a mug of. Ale. Just any ale? Uh, the good ale. Dwarven it is. I'll run you a silver or a cup. Is it actually made of dwarves? No, it's made no. by dwarves. Uh, uh, okay. Alright, Oscar hands the man a silver. I hand the man a gold. No, that, that's a gold, brother. <laughs> yeah, I know. I see you're wanting lots of drinks. Yeah. Just how many? Well, the a whole gold. gold or just some of it? The whole gold. Alright. Well, I'll keep it in mind. You get one tankard. Come back when it's empty and I'll refill it for you. 
Alright then. Works for me. He's got a keg and he's just... He's got a tapped keg and just... <laughs> pours some... Uh, tankards of ale for you. So, uh... The bear having a good time? The bear Surrounded is... By people? Clearly currently nervous. <laughs> Oscar will hang out with the bear. It's just sitting behind you, Grok and Oscar. I just want to play. I'll play just carry Victoria to these tables to the corner. And just put on a seat and just have a stomp down. I'll definitely have something a little heavier hitting if you have any. Yeah, I'll have Prince too. That maybe four or so. Well, I don't. Lady, were you asking for something heavy as well? I just want one, uh, not heavy, but just normal drinks. Just some normal ale? Alright. That'll be, uh, five copper. That'll do. Uh, my good man, I've got just a thing for you. A bit pricey, but it's definitely heavy. As long as it doesn't break five gold, I think I'll be more than happy. Oh, perish just thought. Just five silver. Perfect. I'll slap down the five silver. Yeah. Steps up, gets an uh, nail for actual. As you were drink, Sunrise, that is. Uh, it comes from a bottle uh, that he keeps under the bar and is a milky purple. Hmm. How does it smell when I go to take a sip of this boil? It smells like violets. Violets? Violets. Pure, violets. <laughs> Pure undiluted violets. <laughs> Ah, that's very refreshing, actually. I will warn ya. It might smell good, but you know, it uh, really live up to its name. I don't suggest drinking more than one of these unless you're uh, looking for an early bed time. <laughs> How much does a bottle of this cost? A whole bottle? A bottle will uh, run you ten gold. Hmm. Well, hopefully I'll, I'll be able to find you in again, but uh, I think one or two maybe. We'll see how I fare yeah. the night. Your little light on gold sunrise. Yeah, the shameful it is to say you did clean me out pretty well. You can make it back if you want. <laughs> yeah, you can make it back too if we beat you. One of, one of these people that's like in between you like turns and looks at you. And, well, we're playing a game of cards here if you fancy a, a light bet. Pay for your drinks. Hmm. I definitely want it on that. I try to just, oh boy, here we go again. I might as well give it a shot. Why'd you that? Someone will die. I'll play, but I'm not paying for um, playing for drinks. I'll play for gold. Well, that's fair. We're playing for gold too. I was just, you know, making the offer. The gold would pay for drink. <laughs> If you get it. I'll throw down for some coin. Alright. What's the buy-in? Well, 
we were having nice friendly matches between us and doing five silver each, but if you're looking for coin, we can uh, make it a gold. I'd buy into that, but... <laughs> <laughs> I love it. So, so immersed. I'm so immersed. <laughs> Would be us to not accommodate the newcomers. You want to play Five Charm or King's Gambit? I think King's Gambit is the usual rules, isn't it? Uh, are you talking about the game that you've been playing this whole? Yeah, I have no idea what either of these games are. I assume I would know in character. <laughs> Bit of a gambling man. Yeah, King's Gambit is the one you've been playing this whole time. <laughs> yeah, that's what I Which is easier on me because it means I don't need to make up gambling. <laughs> yeah. I'll throw down for some King's Gambit. <laughs> Alright, good to hear it. See all of them put a coin into the middle of the table. Three, yeah. three, Look three. to the rest of your group. Any of the rest of you feel like joining in? I'm good. How about you, brother? If I join and lose, someone will die. I'm good. Well, you best stay over there, then. Yeah, he's a bit <laughs> angry about our friend here cleaning us out pretty clear, pretty thoroughly on the last rounds. Have you actually had any of your drink yet, Josh? Yeah, uh, I've already sculpted through most of them. Oh, you mean, you mean Sunrise. Josh. I will... Is your name Josh? Look, yes. I didn't hear the word Josh. He said Ugrosh. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> but uh, I'll start sipping on it. Alright, the uh, flavor starts off like soft and fruity, mm. uh, but the aftertaste is extremely sour. Oof. I, I love it. Ah, sweet at the start and bitter tart at the end. Just like so many good women. So, if you're joining in, roll your hands. Throw your bones, gentlemen. That's a lot of twos. Holy shit! Oh, no. Uh, no. We've, he's lost, boys. He's lost. Hmm. I mean, they've got the tops pretty much one already. I was very rolling my uh, first two. Get fucked. No, I'm gonna move them just aside a little bit so I can actually see you all. <laughs> Four fours. I'm just gonna try uh, re-roll one of the twos. One, two, three, four, six, fuck. No, I got nothing. Four of a kind. Literally nothing. Uh, first guy will re-roll his three. It's another three. Second guy will re-roll his three. So. Two sixes. Not like it matters. The last guy will re roll his three. A lot of threes getting re rolled. down the hands while I was like well I suppose that would be my win would you like to go again 
Did he have four twos? Yes, he did. I, I had four fours. Oh, you did? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. See, you did really well. <laughs> the guy next to him just kind of nudges him on the shoulder and it's like, what? Oh. oh. My bad. Pushes the coins towards you. Would you Thanks. like to go again? Gladly, friend. Mm. It's almost good enough for his old bottle already. <laughs> Alright. Now I'll put another coin down. Hell yeah. Is there any music going on in this place? Uh, none that I've put on. Can we roll that too? That's what you're on. You are live on a place out, brother. Awfully dull in here. <gasps> Boys. Looks at Horn. <laughs> I don't think appreciate this. I mean, am I? I think you play good. Keeping the two fives. Wait, you also have a horn? No, damn it. <laughs> horn boys. Horn boys. <laughs> 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 <Dude> noises. <laughs> Dudes aggressively. Yeah, I play Megalovania on my horn. Do it. <laughs> Do it. Do it. Do it. Do it. Do it. Oh, no. Do it. Yeah. And it's got a good hand today. Just hmm. Top down. If only I had drums, I'd play my drums while you do the dude. Then we would have a full Donkey Kong Country play. Because <laughs> I have proficiency with drums. Boom, 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 boom. Donkey Kong. Alright, that round. Got to top again. What's over you, Ander? Seems we're uh, evenly matched on this one. Mm -hmm. Wanna split the pot, or should we have a one on one round? How much would the pot be? One, two, three, four, five. Between the five of you, it's five gold, yeah. You can't really split five. Double or nothing! Well, it's not like we don't have... What? Well, you know, I've got five silver that I can break a gold for. You know want to roll again? I'm happy to. Very happy to go again. Rerolling that too. Boy. Spicy. Destruction. <laughs> oh. Oh. I think you just got wiped. Oh, fuck. Yeah, I just, <laughs> just got wiped. floored hard, man. Both of you. Lost of full hands. you put yours down with confidence and he just plays out his matched five set across the table. Read him and weep. 
melt. Have fun with that. Yeah, you show that knifeies. Take the stack of coins. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus Christ. How much more do you need for your drink, Sunrise? Well, I have enough. I'm just enjoying this. <laughs> Do you all like to go again? Maybe say, make it a little more interesting this time. Depends on how you want to make it interesting. I was thinking, double the bet, and we'll play blind. No re rolling. No re rolling. But. Puts two of the coins on the table. If you want to raise or add anything to the pot, you do so before we flip. Hmm. I'll throw it down for this. Yeah, I'll just put the two in. Sorry, I had to do something real quick. What's that? I'll just, um, me and Josh are both putting two gold in. Mm -hmm. Alright. Yeah. Sorts the cards out between them. I'm just gonna get rid of these since they're on the dirty. E. Looks the pair of you. He's like. Uh, are you ready? Indeed I am. Alright. And flip. Two pair. Two pair. Two pair. Two. Well, the guy with the fives and the sixes definitely won. <laughs> oh, he did. I like a crown icon. This guy is too good at this game. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, this will. <laughs> Cheating. <laughs> oh no, Matt's home. It's gonna be uh -oh. yeah. 500 fart noises inbound, boys. The bear is back. Oh, I'd God. say that's my win. You wanna go again? Double or nothing. <laughs> I mean, I'm not using this gold for anything else, really. You're on. So he's, he's leaving the pot in there as we get to hear the crinkle state. Yeah, just pulls out another two coins and adds them to the pile that's already in the middle. Yep, I'll check two more. Check two more. This is my last hand if I fail this. Gamble responsibly. <laughs> Gamble responsibly, kids. Let's throw his whole cash in. Gamble, here. Gamble responsibly. Bitcoin. <laughs> Bitcoin farming. Yeah. Hands out the cards to everyone. So damn. There goes nothing. It's okay. Pretty good. Oh, that's not English. <laughs> oh, I missed one. Well, there we go. Go fuck another again. Oh, 
unfortunately, I believe fours and ones. Uh, two pair of fours and does beat two pair of threes. Yep. <laughs> uh, I just lost like. See, even this guy looks like a little guy that he's won so many in a row. And he's like, Again? Really? Yeah, this is like starting out here, not. Mm. You're a cheat, aren't you? <laughs> <laughs> What's up? No! Ah! Oh, I swear! Double or nothing. Are you really willing to go again? I throw down four coins now. <laughs> Looks to the other two, uh, one of them backs out. <laughs> I walk up and I sit down and I just watch with my drink. Well, this is it, boys. I'll put four down as well. Alright, fine. I'll go again, but... I want something a little more than gold for this one. Mm. Putting a lot on the line here. This pot... This pot's already at 20 gold. What do you want my... You want my car to? Well, what have you got on you? Not much, I love shit on me. I do have... Oh, just my spear, dagger, and... Oh, a couple of other travel supplies. You want some dirty robes and a tinderbox? I ain't giving I was thinking you my something a little more fancy for He uh, draws a dagger from his pocket, which is has a crystal embedded in the cross guard. Oof. It's a, you can tell it's very finely crafted. Spins it in his hand and stabs it into the table. To which gets a small oi from the barkeep. <laughs> I was thinking something more like this. Hmm. I do you have uh, much interest in clocks. Depends on the clock. Uh, for one of the first times ever, I will actually take mine off and turn it inside out where all the colors are that Darby hates. To look at it. <laughs> I'm fold it up neatly and set it on the table. With all the various materials and colors that I've weaved into dragon scale form. He raises an eyebrow. Alright. That'll do. What about you, elf boy? Got anything I, to offer? I really don't carry much on me other than my, my weapons, which I can't give up. I'll put in seven gold. Yeah. See, uh, looks to his buddy. His buddy just shrugs. Fine. <laughs> Out of character, I, I literally have nothing other than my weapons. <laughs> <laughs> I have a walking stick. Yeah. And plays out cards to ever. He goes, just for this one, we'll have one special rule. Before hmm. we reveal, you can choose how many cards you got in place. Okay. You must announce it before we flip. So how many cards we have to play? Wait, that makes no sense. Because you could play one, one, and say you've got a full house of ones. What? What? Yeah, I'm saying. 
before we reveal, right? Points it is five cards laid out in front of him or face down. Now, I say I'm going to replace two of mine. No matter what my results, even if I happen to have another five of a kind, I'll have to replace two of them. This mm -hmm. is for you to bet on your own luck to see if you can figure out whether or not you've got a good hand now or if you'll need to try again. Alright then. Now, I'm sticking to what I said. I'm doing two. He looks through his bunny, he goes, I'll go three. Oh, so you're going to call how many you're re rolling before you roll? Correct. I'll re roll one. Yeah, I'll go with one as well. Alright. In that case, reveal. I actually mark these ones down again. <laughs> These guys have clearly screwed themselves over because they both got two pets. <laughs> <laughs> I'll re roll my six. Or not my six. I'm looking at the six. I'll he re said my two. Six. We'll do uh, the five and one of the one. He's worse off now. Two. Three. This guy has said three. I'm going to reroll my two. Great. Fuck, I have nothing. So, as the chat is now a clear fucking mess of numbers. Reroll my two. Oh, two, two fours, fours, two three. That gives Thunrise a two pair, which would actually mean he wins. Thank fuck. Oof. At least one of us got it. <laughs> <laughs> well, friend. Very good game. See, so you just sighs. I think I should have just said one. <laughs> I'll uh, pick my cloak up and uh, put it back on. <laughs> I actually said you didn't lose that thing. For that, I will turn it inside out and so the colors on the outside now. <laughs> so you can reverse it. Uh. Uh, scoop up that nice little dagger and then... Uh, I'll still leave a gold for our friend who lost his era. Sorry, but at least you could still get some drinks, friend. Yeah, it's, uh... See, a few of the, uh, other patrons kind of smirking at them. You can tell they've probably swindled a few of the people here out of their money. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God, how much gold was that now? Twenty-five? <laughs> Uh, there was 20 gold in the pile before, before this round. I added 7. When Ed added 7, everyone else added 4. Which brought it to a total, uh, given that there was not 5 people in that last round, uh, of 36. Woot woot. 36, 30... Nine. Alright, so I'm at 38 because I gave the guy one gold back. 
as a semi apology for breaking his bank, but them's the deals. <laughs> well, Leander, I suppose I should get you another drink as I'll slug the rest of mine back. <laughs> yeah, I'll like walk up and like pat him on the back and be like, Whew. glad one of us won that. <laughs> Yeah. Why are you doing that, these guys? Uh, the other two here try to go back to having just like their friendly games, and the other guys just ignoring them at the moment. <laughs> go back to my corner. So, uh, yeah, I'll enjoy that nice, fanciful little dagger I've got now. <laughs> to win eventually, didn't you? See, I was saving my luck up to the very end. I rolled horribly every single round. The best I got was like three of the kind ones. But, uh, I'll, at that point I'll go to the barkeep and I'll definitely be taking a bottle of that food. Nods and uh, you uh, bought it now or uh, when you leave. Ah, might as well have it now. Let's share with my friend here. Nods and uh, pull out, puts it on the counter. Here you go. This one's uh, this one's unopened. Thank you. I'll slap down the ten gold for him. The nice little stack. So, anything of interest back at Downhold for you, or you're just trekking around, seeing how your previous line of work is, uh, well, not very welcoming back after what happened. Yeah, uh, not really. It was sort of just the closest town to where I'm from. Where are you from? Where? Ah! Little elven city we almost came across the other day. Oh. Might have sort of avoided it. Ah, running away from home then. Yeah, something like that. Might be a little bit illegal for me to go back there. I didn't put me. Very clearly that I'm not a uh, a skilled monk. Uh, I'm sure you see him, the amount that I've taken care of my cloak and everything else that I'm much better at weaving. Family business. I kind of wanted to give it up. Head back to the Donald. No, many were very happy with that situation, so joined the monastery. And then sell yourself short. You really fucked up some birds the other day. <laughs> I scared oh, some birds. <laughs> I scared birds. That's about the most I will boast. So we're just gonna have like a couple drinks before we head out, or because it's still like early morning, right? So we woke up to find this tower. I would figure we'd have a, little, a few more drinks before heading back out. Besides, it will spare natural the heinous task of carrying around the muffin. I was just still dozing, just, you know, just, you know, all just crap, just crash on the table. <sighs> just enjoy my drink. And... Why is I don't care why she's so sleepy. I just just trotted out but no tomorrow. Uh, she did say she wants to die. Maybe she went into one of those 
weird priestly comas. What is it? Is it like a vision? Like a quick log vision? What do you uh, care to have? Ah, uh, well, I would imagine they're God probably borrowing them. Or just catatonic. Hmm. Maybe. You could just leave her here. She probably wouldn't die. She wouldn't even know where we went. And she'll wake up on the other side of the continent. <laughs> <laughs> well. <laughs> we could leave her here. Then again, she's fairly interested in death. It would be entertaining to see if uh, somehow she does make her way back. Perhaps. Then again, this place seems That's... relaxed and peaceful enough, anyway. But she is kind of useful. Oh, you make a good point, Oscar. Yes, she is very usable. Well, I mean, to each the preference. <laughs> yeah. Leander made a bit of a face about that statement, like, what? <laughs> not, uh, not very sure what you are playing in, Oscar, unless you have taken a, a fancy to her. Personally, not my, uh, <coughs> preference. No, I mean, like, she's our property. <laughs> That was just having worse. Well, you guys didn't pick up on that. We did find her. Find yeah, those keepers. Fine. Yeah, we. Three second rule. Well, at least you've been keeping tabs on your property then. I wonder if she has any gold. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, you can go and check her if you want, friend. I'm not about to stop you. Though then again, a lot of people see someone fiddling with a uh, woman's waist in pouches, then uh, they're going hey, to you, get a you're bit of a wrong idea. Our property, you knife-eared bastard. <laughs> Did you mind if people is having like over half a dozen, over a dozen people here watching? Did you go around through someone who's sleeping? That's a bit. So go always questions. Lots of questions. I mean, look at her here. She looks just like me. They'll think... They'll think I'm her sister. She's my sister. Whatever. You're... I'm not even going to broach that one. <sighs> Bartender just looks between you. You know I can hear you, right? You're at the counter. Yes, you can call them idiots, too. I mean, unfortunately, I've been kind of kidnapped with the rest of these, but still alive somehow. I take a shot of this drink. <laughs> what drink? The one that the I one slugged that back. <laughs> oh, okay. Have well. a bottle for the road and an extra glass to go. Both of you roll, uh... On checks. Fuck! Drunken boxing! Drunken <laughs> boxing! Alright. Sunrise? Plastered. Yeah, pretty much. Thank and you, uh, you uh, feel a bit of numbness at your, like, the tips of your fingers. It's mm. just a slight slurring to your speech, but aside from that, you're actually holding up okay. You weren't lying by tender, are you? I'm really enjoying this drink. <laughs> but sunrise, can you can you hold your liquor or do you need some help? Well, clearly I can hold it. It's in my hand, isn't yeah, it? So far. Hey, that's uh, that's Angel Blast for you. <laughs> I 
Tastes fruity. Smashes your taste buds. Citrus. Makes you dying in a gutter within an hour. <laughs> oh, don't worry. I've done enough of that this week already. <laughs> well, lucky for you, we don't have any gutters. Even better point. I'm definitely going to have to come back here if I ever spot you again when we're traveling. Of course, of course. Do come in whenever you uh, find us. For a returning customer's uh, discount, you know. Uh, I don't know about you two. Big Gulugs and Fellow Bear. Mm. I would imagine well, after a good couple of drinks and rounds there, I should probably hit the road again before all of our sunlight is completely gone. Well, we don't want to go where this walking in is going. So. We want to find somewhere that we can make camp. All the more reason to head out then. I'll just finish the last few me drinks then. I imagine I haven't got many left. It depends how fast you've been smashing them back. Well, I mean, we did a few rounds of gambling. He's probably gone through a few cups, maybe. Yeah, I feel, I've, I've probably got like what five left, maybe. If that's how many you want. Yeah, let's go for it. Them. Yeah, fuck yeah, smash it down, bud. <laughs> Quick, give the bear some. Drunken bear. Drunken bear. Drunken bear. <laughs> See, Matt is like sniffing at the tankard. I do place it next to him. Like, you wanna, you wanna look at it a bit. He um. And just like leans down to it, starts lapping some up with his tongue. Eh? Huh. Nah? What? <laughs> Turn the bear into an alcoholic fuck. It's Russia. <laughs> I'll slug back the rest of me drink. Don't care that a bear just dropped on it. Uh, the bear wants the wench. The bear makes a con save and he's barely sober. You know what? The bear is quite young. I'm gonna give him a con save. <laughs> oh no. Why did that put the bear? I was using the black bear stat sheet for him just because he's small. It'll be brown bear once he's bigger. It works. Uh, con. Ooh, bye bear. Yeah, the bear is having trouble standing up. <laughs> I will finish my drinks, and then I will Even carry the bear. He up, like he starts kind of cuttering side to side until he sits down again. Alright, carry, carry Matt, will you, brother? Alright, <laughs> oh, do that. Oh, yeah, sorry, she. Uh, yeah. <laughs> I keep forgetting Matt's a girl. I will, I will like kneel down and like splay my arms out and be like, "Come on, up." <laughs> uh, roll an animal handling. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> cool. I was initially gonna say at disadvantage, but the bear's also trunks. So. <laughs> <laughs> bear just kind of. And, uh, you know what, I'm just gonna flip a coin here. Uh, I'll let you decide. Heads or tails, or he claws you by accident. Oh no. <laughs> well, um, I'm let's flipping go... a coin, I'm letting you decide which side is. Heads, he, he fucks me up. Tails, he does not. Alright, well, it's easy starts climbing onto you and start to dig in. And then he kind of leans back a bit and just 
wide arm just. <laughs> you are fine. He did not claw you. <laughs> yes. He did not claw you. Can't handle this drink. <laughs> I haven't had to carry a beer before. No experiences every day. It is very heavy, but it is also you. <laughs> it is also you. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it's fair. Because you're like holding it up. To you. This is a new experience for the bear too. All right, let's get going. I'll put you down once you're sober. <sighs> well, in that case, I picked up a toy where I left it on a like, chair and table and just throw up my shot again. <sighs> Got to be knocked out. Should probably put her in a backpack or something. <sighs> I don't know if that'll work. You need a muffin harness. You can tie it to your back. Just got some rope. Yeah, tie it on my back, I'll carry you. Yeah. That's alright. I've got no. rope hanging off me bag, brother. Yeah. yeah. I'll help you, help you. Just bring her on over and turn her on. <laughs> Sunrise absolutely fucking sloshed. Nothing. <laughs> <laughs> Walking around with vibrant fucking colors on the clock. <laughs> the symbol of on my back. So, uh, you gonna head out then? Might as well. Yeah. I'm grabbing a door and. Start. Start. So continue. Hey, Barkeep, oh. what's your name? Never got it. I never gave it to you. It's, uh... My name is, uh... Asta. Asta Belenin. Asta Belenin. I look forward to seeing you again, hopefully. Sometime in the future. Mm. I need to go. This psychotic one is going to be holding my horn in the moment. Small hint. It's the paladin. <laughs> Just, uh, start shuffling. <laughs> Alright, well, you take care then. I do yes. hope to see you again. Don't worry. If you see me bleeding out in the forest, I'm not dead. I just was traveling with these guys still. You see, as Ugrox walking out, you hear, If you get left behind, you stay behind. As <laughs> he calls out the sunrise. <laughs> Dude, it's fair. It's fair. What's this? the code? You go to walk out the door, find that the, uh, that out the door you have about uh, one foot of like wooden platform and then air. Eh. Hey, what? Oh, shit. See that the inn has already started to move. I've been kidnapped. Ten Nobody. feet off the ground. This is your fault, <laughs> Uh. What? <laughs> <laughs> Can't Who's closest to reason. the ledge? Not sure if I can reasonably get down while carrying a bear. Is there, is there something wrong over there? It The bar's not on the ground again. Oh. Are we moving already? I like, I go outside to look. Damn it, those idiots. Aren't you the one that controls this? <sighs> Alright, look. I like you guys, so I'll be honest. The thing earlier about my trade secrets, complete joke. The bar moves because I made a pact with a bunch of elementals. 
That's amazing. Have some earth elementals to lift the tavern up and keep it nice and smooth uh, as we travel around. They're very good for that, the way they can shift the earth around them. Well, that's good and all, but can you tell them to set us down just for a minute? I'd like to go. No. No, I can't. So, Leander's gonna grab the two closest people really to him. Unfortunately, they're in charge of the whole thing. All I do is sell drinks. Oh. Leander's Wait, you gonna wanna get to the ground, go through that pool in the middle. Oh. It doesn't actually have a bottom, but it uh, is not actually water either. Well, that's freaky, but all right. Yeah, that one's a water elemental. He's nice enough. He'll uh, lower you down to the ground. All right. Eh? Just try not to get run over by the earth elemental. Thing. Freak. We got a go Light through. In the case water you thing. Don't. Uh, hello, water. Can we go down? See the uh, hmm. only response you get from the water is it just creates like a slight wave. It was feel like it was completely smooth, and now there's like a ripple in it. Well, he wasn't lying. It's some weird things. Oscar sticks his hand in it. The water, uh. Almost seems to like squeeze around your hand gently. <laughs> oh, Jesus Christ! <laughs> it, like it feels like it's grabbing onto you. I stick my dick in it. <laughs> <laughs> Don't fuck the water! Don't fuck the water! Alright, Oscar climbs in. I feel like there's someone I should be giving that advice to, but. They probably exist on a different plane of existence. I feel like his name would be Brad. Oh, I don't know what I was thinking, but... You know, that, that also sounds kind of familiar. <laughs> you say Brad, I hate him already. Yeah, me too. All right, Leander. What a stupid name. Uh, Leander, roll uh, acrobat. Breaks the legs. <laughs> Slips. Alright. You drop down, uh, you hit the ground, you tuck in and do a nice little. And take no falling damage. I go with Matt through the portal. Hold on. You fall down into it, you can see uh, that. Underneath is underneath the water is just air, so it has clearly it's clearly just like floating in this. Right. Fall through it. It almost seems to stretch down towards the ground with you, and lets you just slide back out, and you only uh, free fall about one foot. Ah, lovely. Thanks, water. <laughs> All right. I'm gonna go right. now with the bear. Flatten it down again. <laughs> the same bear. happens for the rest of you as you all go through it. Yep. When I walk Carrying up to the, the edge, I will literally just like board plank fall flat into it. <laughs> no, IRL Matt. You are not even wet after it drops you off. <laughs> it's not a wet bear. <laughs> wet bear. Just we were just hopping, just weird, weird. We've got some weird people in our chat tonight, boys. <laughs> you How are we talking? They're talking about screwing the water. <laughs> I mean, I did start this, and I am not you sorry. Did. Fact, 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 said fact, the water just... is the tavern hooker. I like it that. is. Would you not stick your dick in gelatin? No. Aeroplane jelly. Oh. See, no one, you know what interesting part is how we walked up pooped. I don't know if you're going to like, come and re-listen to this episode and see what Because <laughs> <laughs> I feel you won't have a girlfriend for much longer. <laughs> <laughs> Look. Look, 
I hate me too. <laughs> we all do. <laughs> anyway. Jeez, you're all deposited. Yeah. Onto the grass. And you see the, uh, on uh, the front and back ends of the tavern. It's just a, like a mound of earth <coughs> up, and it's just lighting the ground, leaving it almost completely undisturbed. The grass and stones seems to either raise up or split around it, and then re back together, leaving no trace in the passage. Yeah, that's that's pretty freaky. Is it just that's very strange? Smoothly drifts away from you now that you're Hey, you just think we'll see it again? Maybe, who knows? I don't have a flat grassland, so we're going back to the riverside, man. <laughs> nice. And we keep walking. We walk for a bit, find somewhere to set up camp. I will slowly stand up from my planked position on the ground. <laughs> Just... <laughs> lead, lead, lead the way, um, Darby. Intend to. Before Rescue. we get too far away from the tavern, I'm going to cast the Tech Planer Portal. <laughs> you find what? In your asshole! It leads to the planar portal. Boop. Detect portal. Alright, it's. One mile, you're in grassland, so... Bless Nothing. You. Onward. <laughs> so, uh, you guys can... have lost a bit of uh, your progress. <laughs> That's a... At this point, I will, I will immediately go up to Atro, partially leaning on her. Little... Who do you worship, anyway? Uh, uh, uh that... Me? Yeah, no. Oh, gosh. No, the, 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 the muffin. Who's a passed out? Both of you. That's a good question. I'll, I'll like, poke the face of Victoria while she's passed out. Like, muffin, who do you worship? You should kind of gotta die. Got it. She worships gotta die. Yes. And you, natural. Uh, I worship uh, Helm. Wait, wait, what? What? Uh, the 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 Helm. Ah, oh, you worship Helm. What's for Helm? What do you mean? No. It's a good choice. Those gods sound stupid. Grumsh is the best god. Mm, they should not compare to Grumsh. Well, everyone has their own beliefs. Except yours is wrong. Saying yours has their own beliefs is wrong, subjective. Sounds puny. Grumptious warrior. Created all orcs. Make us strong. Mm. I, I could see that being handy for you. Of course. Uh, uh, speaking from philosophy through uh, some bottled eyes is like he kind of like wanders off through a little bit to the side before coming back to the crew 
you're just. I, an... I think I think we should probably set up camp now, so you all can recover from your party out. I'm Which fine. Was... She's fine. If he can keep moving, he can keep walking. So you watch, watch this. He just fucking runs ahead for no reason. <laughs> <laughs> okay, but he could be more fine. Yeah, that is true. At least he's enthusiastic. I mean, at the same time, we do have not only Victoria here, our call, but also Little Bear, too. Bear seems to be doing alright. <laughs> I was wondering if anyone was gonna notice that. <laughs> yeah. Oh wait, sorry, right, get back here. <laughs> As I said, he went in the opposite direction, so don't think I would having a munch, drunk, and then swinging wildly and missing all the time is a good idea. I've got this. Dead. Right, back here. Just break his leg if you need to. Uh. <laughs> no, not your bed. <laughs> yeah, then you might want to give uh, Oscar a hand with this. Matt's just like wiggling, trying to get out of here. <laughs> <laughs> trying to join the race. Like holding Matt up, like, are you, are you, you can you stand? I like put him down. I put her down. Totters a little bit and then just sits down and then just lays down. <laughs> Close. Mm. Alright, I guess Matt wants to rest, so I guess we should set up camp then. Alright, let's get, but get back here, sunrise. No! <laughs> I'm making progress! Oh, it's time for sleep. Uh. He gets himself killed, it's his own problem. <laughs> Sprints off into the night and never <laughs> to be seen again. <laughs> Finally, I'm going to go away from that action. By bandits, and the following morning, you find his dead body. <laughs> Excellent. He finds the, a name carved into the dirt. Atrial. What <laughs> 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 did this? And a curse and draconic written under it. <laughs> Eventually, just fucking come back like, hey, what's going on? Why is the We're bear down? The bear is down. She's passed out. We have two muffins. We scamp and go get, go get some wood or something. Right. You look like you've got plenty of energy. Yeah, get some dry wood. That's a great idea. I'm gonna go climb a tree and start snapping branches off. We didn't need that tavern, you hungry brother. Always brother. I'll go get us something to eat. Oh, I'll head off. Alright, uh, well, you know, background fee, that's reasonably enough for you. Yeah. Oh. Despite the background feat, I do want to try find a bigger game, like a deer or something. Alright, well, want something bigger. Survival. What was that? Survival. Survival. Yep. Survival. Alright. 